Hello, ladies and gentlemen, my name is Parker. Welcome back to once again to another Call of Duty Mobile video today. Today, I'm going to be teaching you how to go and play Call of Duty Mobile, but on your PC here. So if you guys do find this video helpful, be sure to go and give it a like. If you guys are new around here, be sure to go and subscribe for future Call of Duty Mobile videos. As well as if you guys want to go and watch me play some Call of Duty Mobile Live, there is a link down below in the description as well as in the pinned comment for my second channel. We had over 1.3k viewers watching me live yesterday playing Call of Duty Mobile, so that was really awesome on my Razer phone too. But with that said, we might as well go and hop into the tutorial here. So here I am on my desktop. If we go and bring in this window right here, we'll be introduced to Game Loop. So this used to be called Tencent Gaming Buddy, and it says Tencent gaming buddy now upgraded to game loop and this is actually run by tencent as well like this is the same developers and same people who went and brought you call of duty mobile here who are now bringing you this official emulator for pc so this is the official website there will be a link down below in the description for you guys to go and follow along with me here but it says play pubg mobile on pc provide you the best experience of fps games even though it says that all you still want to go and do is click download and we have the exe file right here just click yes and even though it says play pubg mobile on pc you're still all set to go just click install there's nothing else you have to do just wait for the whole thing to go and install here and if i'm not mistaken not only will this go and oh nice it says start so yeah here we go it says game loop right here so we'll just go click on game loop just click yes there and we should be logging in for the very first time. And yeah, this is awesome. Call of Duty Mobile available on Game Loop now. So I guess without further ado, we'll just go and click download for that. And we should be going and installing Call of Duty Mobile. It's going to be a 1.2 gigabyte file. So just click install. And it's going to go and install here for uh, Game Loop. Now, I do understand the controversy because a lot of people are saying like, oh, Parker, isn't this going to be cheating? Now players who are just going and using their phone are going to be going up against people who are using a mouse and keyboard. Uh, but I will say this, and even that, like there was just a notification that just popped up saying that the anti-cheat has been enabled. So you won't be able to really use hacks for this emulator here as well. And it just said that it failed to install. Here, I'll just go and click continue here. Hopefully everything should be back but i know the controversy behind this but, but don't you guys worry for everyone who is using an emulator you're only going to be thrown into lobbies with other people who are also using emulators and not people who are using like an iphone for example or your android device so those servers are just going to be completely separate as well as like for people who are using controllers as well so here we are we just went and loaded into call of duty here we can go and maximize the screen we'll go and click play now for playing cod m game loop has has perfect mimic of PC gaming controls pressing WASD to move and using mouse to control aim down sight okay so we'll just click next skydiving opening doors press F to try intelligence supports the following parachute okay nice and we might as well go and play this so not supported on this device so we have to play at 1080p even though I do have a really solid PC the game resolution has been changed we'll just go and restart now just to verify Everything is good. And here we go. We're loading into Call of Duty Mobile for the very first time. Now, right now, I might as well go and actually show you guys how to set everything up in terms of just the controls alone. Because, yes, this is going to be an emulator for your PC here. And the whole logging in process for this should be somewhat easy as well i'd have to imagine but yeah this is actually my first time loading in here so this should be some really exciting stuff if you guys do once again find this tutorial helpful be sure to go and give it a like we might as well go click accept okay so i guess we might as well go sign into guest here and let's just make parker ytt because <laughs> my uh, gamer tag on uh, call of duty mobile is just parker yt but here we go, ladies and gentlemen. So I would have to imagine we're probably going to go and experience the tutorial mode. So we'll kind of just go through all the motions here with it. Like continue, tap anywhere. Okay. So yeah, this is like, there's no remapping that you have to do. This is pretty much just going and playing this game. I did no remapping. Like everything is perfect here. F to go and pick up. We can just go and move over here. I am just using my mouse and keyboard here to go and play this game. 
I can probably go and change some of these settings later because for the tutorial mode and oh dang this is exactly like if you were to go and play PUBG on just the PC here so tap to aim it's literally just left or right clicking the mouse and uh, everything works escape wow that is so fluid this is really awesome here okay go over to here settings so just going through the tutorial here tap to hold ADS there we go and then we might as well just go and confirm advance here yeah man this is really awesome I was not expecting it to be this smooth of an experience we'll go pick up this weapon right here I'm assuming there's some more people who we're gonna have to go and kill over here for the tutorial I would love to go and hop into a game here because like I said the only other players who you're gonna be going up against are just other people who are also using emulators but this feels really smooth Especially, I don't know if you guys have used this emulator on like PUBG Mobile, for example, but yeah, man, this is such a smooth experience. And I think that should be it for the tutorial mode there. We'll just continue. So here we are. We're loading into a Nuketown frontline game against bots. And uh, I don't know, man, like just for the tutorial alone, it felt really smooth. Let's see what it's actually like in game because it's really responsive. This is like playing a PC game on your PC here, but it's just an Android emulator. Like I said, this is extremely responsive. I was expecting a little bit of like a delay or the controls just to feel really weird. But yeah, just like running is nice. I just got like a little bit of lag there, but other than that, yeah, man, just reloading is perfect. Like this could actually be a lot of fun for other people who like don't want to go and adjust to going in uh, using like a touchpad. This can easily be the best solution here. Like if you guys have a PC, I don't even think you have to have like the best PC in the world to go and run this too. But yeah, you can definitely use a lot of the techniques in Call of Duty, just like running and sliding and everything like that. Like everything is working for me here so far. Um, even though I'm still going to be sticking to my touchpad here, this is still like a great alternative. Once again, for people who don't really want to go and use a touchpad. Oh no, oh no. And oh dang, I already have my streaks here too. Nice, calling in your kill streaks, and of course, yep, I... I uh, just killed myself. Calling in your kill streaks are like easy to go and do. Everything's already kind of remapped for you. I'd have to imagine if we go into our settings as well, we'd probably be able to go and remap our own controls. We can go and check that like settings. Um, like you can change all this too. We can go all the way up to the very max settings if we wanted to. Max frame rate. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Uh, controls. We can customize everything here. Hip fire if we want to right off the bat rather than auto zooming. Yeah, dude, this is perfect. It's extremely customizable, which I'm really surprised by. But yeah, man, even swapping weapons is really smooth. Just like going and using the scroll thing here. We have all our other teammates here going on too. Like this is a really smooth experience. I was not expecting it to be this awesome. Yeah, man, this is so much more responsive. When it came to the controller for Call of Duty Mobile, like it wasn't really that as like fluid as these controls are, but this is really, really solid here. Nice, we already have a lot of our streaks going in here. Guy coming off from over here and you can easily go and tinker around your with your uh, sensitivity settings here as well like I didn't really do that much in terms of like my settings and like changing anything but yeah if you really wanted to you could really zone in and pick the stuff that you want oh gosh okay so using the predator missile and oh okay using the predator missile is a little bit wonky like you can't just go and use it normally and oh yo knifing is really awesome right now I would say that the knifing aspect of this is a lot more fluid than just playing on your phone. Guys over here. Yeah man, this is exactly like playing Call of Duty on just like a normal PC here. Like, I don't know if you'd be able to go and tell the difference between like just Black Ops 4 controls and then the controls on this. You would not expect for it to be like an emulator whatsoever. This is just such a smooth experience. We can go and call this in again. Yeah, like I said, you have to actually go and, like, drag the Predator missile and where you're going to go and use it. But other than that, this is... I'm very impressed with this. Calling this. Oh, dude. This might be game, depending on how many people... Oh, there's only one more? Okay. Can I get that snipe? 
Oh no, I always sell almost the final one. But ladies and gentlemen, that is going to be the video today. Thank you all so very much for tuning in and watching. If you guys found this video helpful, be sure to go and give it a like. If you guys are new around here, be sure to go and subscribe for future Call of Duty mobile videos. My name is Parker. Hopefully you guys are having a wonderful, fabulous day because I certainly am. And I guess I'll talk to you guys in the next video.